And Prince George's County, that's where we're headed to now, where women and teens who are homeless or at risk of having nowhere else to go have a new place to turn to for help. The nonprofit Arnold Place Inc. just opened a transitional home in the county and will start housing women next month. So this morning, we are so happy to have Tracy Arnold. She's the founder and director of Arnold Place, <laughs> and she's here to tell us all about it. Good morning, Tracy. Thanks Good for joining morning. us. Good morning. Thank you. First of all, congratulations. Thank you. This has been a long time coming, certainly yes. a dream come true. Uh, you started Arnold Place back in 2014, mm -hmm. and this was to help teens and women uh, who are struggling with uh, abuse or who've come out of domestic violence situations. I want you to talk about what it's like for these girls and these women out there. Well, actually, when we started Arnold Place in 2014, this is when I was established. This is when I was approved for mm -hmm. my nonprofit um, organization. The work that we've done so far is doing the research, trying to see exactly where we could benefit. Mm -hmm. So we, although we hadn't had our home open yet, we were able to get out into the community and help women with clo clothing drives, mm -hmm. sometimes doing benevolence help, different things like that, doing Christmas time, doing toy drives to help with um, different needs that people may have. And this means a lot. I mean, you see teens as young as 16, some pregnant, and they're, they're going through a lot. Yes. Right? So we're excited now because yeah. we finally meet, met, met our match. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? We're, we're at the point that we've been working towards for the last 10 years. So mm -hmm. now with Arnold Place being able to open April 1st, we're excited because now we'll be able to transition from just collecting clothes and doing something during the holiday season mm -hmm. to now being able to house these women. So it's very exciting. Definitely. We're going to see some pictures in just a minute, mm -hmm. but I do want to touch on your experience. You are a veteran. Uh, a real estate professional yes. and at one point you found yourself near homelessness as well yes talk about that experience briefly 1998 I became a, a mortgage consultant um, and my career was very well I did very well as yeah. a mortgage consultant I went on to 2005 opened up my own mortgage business employed 32 employees mm -hmm. then the market crashed and I didn't prepare myself properly and that's the truth and I found myself about to face homelessness. If it wasn't for family and friends, mm -hmm. I too would have been out on the street. And that's when it really got into my system that I must do something because we're not our situation. Mm -hmm. Sometimes things just happen in life mm -hmm. that causes us to take a bad turn, but it's not that we're bad people. So. Right. And now you're helping other people who are faced to find themselves in that situation or near. Let's talk about the home. We're excited about this. <laughs> we can't disclose the location for, right. uh, for privacy That's reasons, right. but just tell us about the home uh, briefly. The home has six bedrooms. Okay, three baths. Um, it's a three level colonial, sits mm -hmm. on 20 acres of land. This is something that we did not want, but it also has a, a pool in the backyard. But you That's know, awesome. we're going to make good of it. But what we'll be able to do, we have two rooms that are dedicated for families. Okay. Whether it's a teen mom who has her children or an adult woman who has her children, we'll be able to house at least two families in these two rooms. The other two rooms will be shared rooms. Okay. And again, this is for teenagers who are 16 years or older and also women who are going through different things. And you can stay from 3 to 24 months. That's right. Tracy Arnold, thank you so much for coming in. Sorry thank we're you out so of much time, for having But we're going to get all this information up on WSA9.com. Thank you so Alrighty, much. Thank you. Yeah.